Good day, viewers. Welcome once again to the Hobby Joan Pilot channel. Today I'm going to fly in a location that I will reveal in a moment. And now for the reveal, as I already have the drone in the air, it's the DJI Mini 3, not the Pro, the DJI most underrated Mini drone in here for the reveal, I mean, total tail. And I'm flying in a familiar area. Although I've not flown here for some time, and I'm flying over the marina, and I'm flying here close to a very famous property owned by, or once owned, I should say by a famous singer, now deceased. And this has now been converted into to villas, which I will tell you about in a, a moment. So, this property was once owned by the famous and legendary musician Prince Rogers Nelson, better known as Prince, who was an American songwriter and musician, widely regarded as one of the greatest musicians of his generation. He died on the 24th of April, 2016. So let me tell you a little about these two villas which were once owned by this legendary musician. The property is situated in the Turks and Caicos Islands and the island of Providenciales and it is situated in an area called or named Tortle Tail. This is a secluded peninsula and the property is gated with a secure with a secured entrance and it offers ocean view for villas. It has a private beach, two outdoor, two outdoors pool overlooking the ocean. It is situated on ten thousand square foot of land or eight acres and between both villas there is 17 bedrooms so there are the east villa and the west villa the east villa has Seven bedrooms with ocean view and one bedroom with marina view. And the prices range from 12000 to 18000 per night. Unbelievable. Unbelievable here, folks. 
Is it worth it? You decide. Our hearts beat to the city streets. We begin to feel the fire. We rise like tall buildings as the chemicals they take us higher. The night's young and it's just begun. As she puts her hand in mine We wanna chase the night You can see the Poplo driveway. So the new owners retain the Poplo driveway, which was a signature of the legendary singer Prince, the man who gave us Poplo Rain. So back to the, the villas, the West Villa. Consists of nine bedrooms, three with ocean view, four with marina view, and two do not have any water view. And the villas in the West Villa also go for a whopping 12,000 to 18,000. Per night amazing absolutely amazing but we talk the tale here in Providenciales Turks and Caicos Islands is one of the areas that the rich and famous hang out where they come to get away from the jobs and the stresses of life where they can relax in peace and uh, privacy and enjoy our absolute blue, pristine waters, our white sand beaches, the sunshine, and in general, the Tufts and Caicos Islands hospitality. And if you could afford it, then I say, Go for it. If it wasn't for the lens of my drone, then no way I would have been able to have such a, a close-up look of this amazing property here right on the marina. And I understand that this marina is judged very deep and it could accommodate a ship up to 150 feet. I don't know if that has ever been done. I'm just going on information that I received, and I also understand that the great man himself, the legendary singer himself, has something to do with the judging of this Marina. So, in the Tox and Caicos Islands, there are several upscale areas where the rich and famous can hang out. 
this is only one. And there are other villas of equal elegance in the Tolotil era. I have another video where I flew along the coastline and where I show a lot of these villas. Absolutely stunning and beautiful scenery here in Providenciales. Ducks and Kikos Islands. And uh, today is a rather overcast and, and gloomy day. It rained heavily all year. In fact, it was raining just shortly before I, I took off. And I have to actually wait out the rain. In fact, I was thinking of leaving and then the the rain subside. The sun briefly burst through the clouds and I thought, well, I should complete the, the mission. So you may ask, where is Tortler Tail exactly? Well, Tortler Tail is on the southern coast of Providenciales. As you can see, I'm right over the, the marina here. And there is the, the private dock and everything. Just looks beautiful. So Tortler Tail is described as a coastal luxury residential region in the Turks and Caicos Islands and Providenciales with some of the finest villas and accommodation and accommodations for tourists. It is described as a narrow peninsula separated from Jubasong by the Flamingo Pond or the Flamingo Lake. And you could see the pond or the lake off in the, the distance. So it's a very secluded area, private security. Lovely beaches and a very good place to hide away here to get lost. So I'm now flying in the opposite direction and there is a, a property here. It's um, still under construction. I think it's in its um, finishing stage. I think what we're seeing there should be some solar panels, but I understand that this is a private um, residential property. I don't know who owns it. I have not found out that information, but this is right on the water's edge here in Tortler Tail. Absolutely lovely property here.
So I was coming in for the landing as my battery was getting low down to about 24%. But then I noticed some persons here and the marina and jet skis. So let's take a look around before we land. We're not going to fly out too far. We have to bear in mind that we are low on battery. I'm just zooming out. So that will save me flying out over the, the marina or too far over the, the marina. And you could see the drone has now gone into post uh, automatic return to home because of low battery. I only had the one battery fully charged here and ready to go. So it's a shame that we couldn't get a better look around the marina and see what the jet skiers were up to. And when I do these flights, I always like to pay attention to our very beautiful low, pure, clean waters here in the Turks and Caicos Islands. And then I'll do a reveal. You will see what has been hiding. And you could see a new villa or two villas are under construction here right again. And the water's edge here in Charlotte Tales. So I hope you enjoy this video. If you do, please share like, comment, most of all, I thank you for watching this video and please give it a thumbs up and I will see you very shortly in another one. Cheers. Bye for now.